instinctively know what you feel like. I've been like that for the last. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, it's all good. It's all good. I still love you. <laughs> Alrighty, so here we go. Competitors are in the middle. In the in the middle of the ring. And uh, this was a oh, match. Julie Star is freaking tall. <laughs> yes, she is. Yes. <laughs> Your Susie has normal cheering on Julie, telling her to squash her like a bug, and you hear Ronnie saying, let's get this over with, RuPaul. <laughs> oh, Lord. That's what I like. That's what I like. <laughs> I, you know, I never looked at, at Julie as a RuPaul wannabe, but you know, yeah, I could see it. <laughs> Sorry. And they say I I'm the and they say I'm the bad one. They say I'm the one hey. that talks about everybody. Whoa. <laughs> that, that 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 is true. It is true. RuPaul is an African American. That that is true. But you know, I I said she's a RuPaul wannabe, not RuPaul himself. So yeah. Okay, we get you. We get you. I think I think you've got that belt cinch too tight around your waist, Susie. <laughs> oh, we'll just move it up a few feet and then we'll and then tighten it up some more and then we'll all be happy. Well, if I had hair, I was like, I'm definitely split my hair. But anyway, back to the match. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I, not everybody can have a famous hairdresser do their hair. But anyway, here we I'm go. All right. <laughs> the perks of being us. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, and there we go. Harmon is, is already ready to watch the hair. As Julie is just wrenching, wrenching her arms right around her there. She's kind of trying to tuck that shoulder out. And there we go. Ronnie kissed her with a snap mare. And I think, I do believe she waited just a little bit too long with that and gave Ronnie uh, some time to think about what, what was going to happen. And yep. Flipped her right over like a pancake. That's a big pancake. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god! Right, picks up and just Irish whips her. Here's Susie still in, still in the, on the sidelines, just yelling and yapping as she often does. Yeah, well, she can yell and yap. I don't really think too many people listen to her. It's uh, kind of like the, um, it, it's kind of like the ch Chihuahua that uh, <laughs> Oth was talking about before. It's kind of like the, oh, and okay. after a while, nobody really pays attention to him. <laughs> Oh, big boot by Ronnie. Goodness. What? <laughs> That's not a move that I, in all honesty, expected to see from Ronnie. Well, she just pretty much knocked Barbie doll down on her butt. Oh, I mean, uh, Julie Star. Just kind of leapt up there and just put a boot to the face, kind of. And she just... Spins around and starts putting a whole bunch of pressure on that shoulder. Oh, 
Man, I thought I thought I knew Ronnie's arsenal. There we used to train together, but doggone it, that surprised me. And look at that, she takes her down again, just steadily focusing on that shoulder. Kids with the toe kick, just kind of putting her down a little bit. She runs off the rope. And clotheslines are just sitting her down. Holy teeth. And she's going Holy right back indeed. at her. Holy cheese indeed. Did you look in the mirror and see that the trailer park there? <clears throat> Sorry about that. <clears throat> She's going right back at her. She's not giving Julie a moment to breathe. Not really a bad uh, strategy, I don't think. Not at all. You stay on the offensive. I mean, we could we could say what we want about Julie. We really can, but you know, we have to give credit where credit is due. As much as it pains me, but um, you know, she is a very a good wrestler. She is a technical wrestler, and she can be very quick. So you know, you do have to stay up on her. Oh wow! Definitely something. I don't know what to call it, but it, definitely something. <laughs> And there's a spear, exactly what I was talking about, and another, a spear, when then she just goes and starts pounding on Ronnie. I mean, this is not going to be a very easy match to win between these two ladies. It, it definitely is not. This is not just a plain old, I'm going to pin you and get the win. No, you have to make the other person actually give up. And I, I don't really see either one of these women giving up very easily. At all. But it's going to turn into a little bit of street fight between them. Just pure ground and pound. Right, exactly. But you can see here, she is just, she is just pounding relentlessly here on Ronnie, and she finally stops and 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 steps back. And and Ronnie, you can see Ronnie is is down. She is down right now. When you take that many straight shots to the head, it'll it'll put a little cobwebs up there. Oh, most definitely. Most definitely. And sh again, she, see, she's going right for Ronnie. She is not giving her any time. This is where I say, you know, she is definitely the technical wrestler. She knows what she's doing. And she Irish whips Ronnie into the corner. Oh, boy, not a good place to be for anybody. Exactly. <clears throat> you hear a crowd semi-rallying semi, um, behind Ronnie. Oh, <laughs> and you see Julie with a couple gut punches just going to the stomach there, and then she backs off. <laughs> and of course, Susie's still talking. Hmm. <sighs> Talking about Ronnie's hair. Well, <clears throat> definitely want to talk I would, about hair. I, I would, I would definitely give her the number uh, of my hairstylist, but she probably couldn't afford her. So, mm. sorry. Actually, I have a team, but you know. I mean, yeah, you got a big old head. You got to have a few people to work on that. <laughs> oh lord alrighty then <laughs> like Julia uh -oh. Ronnie set up on that top rope she definitely does she she is she is setting her up for something you are absolutely right oh look at this she caught her with a super plex wait no Wow, 
all we we all can't look we all can't look as good as I I do I mean you know that's just it just takes it's her just it's just facts oh and there we go <laughs> this kind of flips her off from up there and man coming off that top rope it's a pretty good little ways up there I know it. I know from a stand seat, it doesn't look like it's that high, but from when you're actually in the ring, you're on top of that top rope, it is, it's a pretty good little uh, distance to the ground, especially when you're upside down. Yes, definitely, and you figure you're you're off the mat, just being on the top rope, what, approximately three, four feet, then you stand on there, and, and then you're being flipped up in the air, yeah, it, it is quite a bit. <clears throat> Harmon, why are you picking on the wrestlers today? <laughs> Harmon came out in real form. You, you better watch, she don't, uh, she don't hit you for saying that about her. Oh, look at this. There, there we go. Ronnie is just shoving Julie right here. Oh, and she's, she's going to town on her now. <laughs> Armin came These out of the form. This, this is... Oh, There's something to behold. A hurricanrana. Uh, you did it right. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. By Ronnie taking Julie down to the mat. And remember, these two ladies are trying to work on each other, trying to uh, wear down each other. That's the word I was looking for. <clears throat> in hopes to win this match. You know, Ronnie just springs right back up and picks her up and Irish whips her. Uh oh. And now Trying Julie's in that corner. Yep, now Julie's the one in the corner. And come through with a corner oh. splash, just kind of snapping her head back a little bit. <laughs> uh oh. Oh now she's taking her leg, putting it around the ropes. <clears throat> And just pulling on it. Oh boy! Kind of, oh boy! Just working that knee against it. Yep, she is working that knee, pulling that, twisting it, and that—that that, as I said before, if you cannot stand, your leverage is considerably taken away. Mm -hmm. You can't get a lot of leverage just on one leg. Ronnie climbs oh, up there and starts delivering straight punches to the face. You can hear the impact, and Harmon starts his count to get try to get Ronnie out of that corner. Now Ronnie's got Julie in a front face lock, and she's dragging her into the middle of the ring. So she's away from all the ropes. Making sure that there's no chance for a rope break. Oh, look at this. Oh, a fisherman suplex. Wow. You know, that's, some, that's some strength right there from Ronnie. Yeah, she's trying to, she looks like she's trying to pin Julie, but again, this is a submission match. This is a submission by, by Ronnie's own request, so pins are not going to count. Pins are definitely not going to count here. She can pin her until all day long and it is not going to get her the win she has to make her submit mm -hmm. ronnie popping right back up picking up picking up julie
<laughs> oh, and look at this. Julie with an eye rake. Talk about sinking down into the bottom of the barrel. Mm-hmm. Hell, like you had to be to poke somebody in the eye. We didn't even poke people in the eye when we fought as kids. That's right. That's dirty pool right there. And Harmon warning them. That's true, off. That's very true. You can dress them up, but you can't take them anywhere. Oh, little wow! Julie with the DDT! She's kind of planting Ronnie on her face. Wow. Oh, Julie's up just standing out. over her. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. That is very true, Off. That is very true. In fact, Susie comes through off of an Irish whip and just does an elbow drop right onto her. Not Susie, Julie, Lord have mercy. Well, that's the, again, you know, smart. That is smart. You gotta give her credit. Using that, using the momentum from the ropes to, you know, put more pressure, more uh, power into that uh, elbow drop. <clears throat> and then again, she's picking her up and again, not wasting any time. She's going at it. She's just working on Ronnie, not giving her any time to recuperate, not giving her any time to think. Uh, you know, just working, working, working on her. So far, this up. Oh, look at this. Oh, and an underhook suplex by Julie. It looks like the tables have turned. I hate to say, right here on Ronnie, and and it's been it's been Julie for the last uh, few minutes here, who's who's had the upper hand. Mm hmm. <clears throat> He's got caught caught Ronnie slipping one time, and then it's just been all Julie since. Definitely, but you know what? You never count out Ronnie because, boy, she finds that that one little little uh, entry point, and she just she'll take it and she will run with it. But right now, it seems like like Julie, oh, excuse me, Julie has gotten Ronnie down, and she's probably trying to figure out a way to make her submit right now. Oh, and uh oh, oh, no. uh oh, and this is it right here. This is a submission move. Ronnie is feverishly trying to grab the ropes, trying to trying to crawl over and grab the ropes. Will she grab them? Yes, she does. She does. And Harmon says a rope break right there. Well, Ronnie very quickly, quickly using her power to crawl over to the ropes so that Julie will break that sharpshooter, hopefully, before damage was done. But that will be determined. It doesn't take very long for a sharpshooter sharp sharp to do mm. it. Hey, say that three times fast. That, that, that. <laughs> It looks like as soon as Julie picked her right hand right. back with a toe kick, kicking her straight in the stomach. And you can hear Susie saying to uh, Julie to drag her out and do it again. Ronnie runs through. Ronnie runs and gets a head start and gets off the rope for some more momentum. Oh! He gets it with a bulldog. Bulldog! Wow! Well, if if this was a pin match, I could see this being the end right here, but it's not. But Julie still is, she's still, well, she's moving, but not very well. 
<laughs> she's moving. She's got that about her. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> and Ronnie yells, "This is it!" And Julie says, "Oh, my face." Well, I'm 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 not going to touch that one. You know, I'm, I'm not not gonna know touch that one. my mind was on the same spot, but I'm trying to I'm trying to be a better person. Oh, and Ronnie says she is done messing around. Uh oh, and here we go. Right, she put her to a figure four leg lock. Uh oh, another I've seen, submission. I've seen many a people tap out to this. I've even put my, oh, my siblings into it before when we were younger. <laughs> I've seen the biggest men tap out. And Ronnie is telling her, come on, tap, come on, tap. Oh, and Julie, quick, very quickly says, I give. I give, and there it is. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Your winner to this submission match is the Black Widow, Ronnie Adams. <laughs> oh, my God. That's a good one. That is a good one. Hey, Ronnie, help yeah. that figure for you in for just a little bit of time just to make Julie remember who she's messing with. Then pops right back up. <laughs> Here Ronnie just standing over her talking. Slips right out of the ring and just heads right back up the ramp. What a match that was. I have to admit, that was a really, really good match. That was and great. in the and definitely. And in the end, Ronnie got Julie and got the win with the sharpshooter. Figure four. Oh, sorry. Figure four. I was I was thinking I was thinking.